a scripture reading this morning, taken from the book, Hebrews 13, verse 8. But before I read the chapter, I just want to thank Brother Raymond for handing out this little piece of pamphlet last week. And for those who didn't receive one, there is, I think, some more outside on the table out there. And I tell you, I don't read this every morning, but some of the morning when I do, see, I read it. And, it, you know, and it's so encouraging. It says, it is one thing to treat the Bible as a book of good moral instruction. To be heeded so far as it constant with the spirit of the times, time sin, or our position in the world. It is another thing to regard it as it really is, the word of the living God, the word that is our life, the word that is to mold our actions, our word, and our thoughts, to hold God's word as anything less than this is to reject it. So as we read God's word, Hebrews chapter 30, verse 8, Jesus Christ, the same yesterday and today and forever. Here we read the words of 